All right. One, two, three. My name is Chrissy, and I sing for Kid Stardust. I got started in Kid Stardust. I actually started this band when I moved here from North Jersey about four years ago. I wanted to start an indie rock band in Cincinnati, and here we are. <laughs> we had no jobs lined up. We moved here with no jobs. We had no idea what we were going to do. And we actually rented a house via Craigslist while we were still in New Jersey from this guy, Joe Cotton. Fuck you, Joe Cotton. No jobs, no money. Like, we're eating like frozen vegetables and nothing else and it was really bad like the first probably four months we lived here we felt like we had made the biggest mistake of our lives and then we met cool musicians yeah. we we're like okay maybe yeah. it's all right uh i'm andrew i play guitar and effects pedals for kid stardust uh, i met chrissy in new jersey I answered an ad on Craigslist. We moved here to Cincinnati and started this band. So how did I start in this band? It was with Chrissy, we grew it. Playing music and stuff for so long, it takes, uh, what is it, resilience? Is that a good word? Yeah. Resilience. Like you really gotta be willing, you gotta love what you're doing and stick it out real long and uh and be willing to be defeated so my name is ryan and i play bass guitar in kid stardust oh and i shout a little bit too so i got started with kid stardust because my buddy matt who originally played one of my dear friends was like hey i met these two people through craigslist i know right craigslist um they just moved to town from New Jersey and they uh, were looking for bandmates. They needed someone to play bass and I had already working with him so he asked me to do it and I was like, is it a punk band? And he said, no, it's not. It's totally different. And I was like, oh man, I can't do it but I'll, I'll try out. And then here I am three years later and now I'm totally stuck. <laughs> I have no idea what I would do if I didn't make music. Um, not, not, not to get sad or too real, but I, I, I physically wouldn't be anywhere right now. My name is Rick. Uh, I play drums in Kid Stardust. I knew Ryan from I don't know. We were friends for years, mutual acquaintances, and he asked me to come try out about two years ago, and I came and uh, I tried out, and um, I, I guess they liked me, I, I think, so far anyway. Um, they haven't told me otherwise, so here I am. You know, I, I feel like we all, because we all kind of come from different places, like we all have like our own thing we put in, so I feel like it forces each of us to grow to like accommodate that person, yeah, like, and it makes something better yeah. than it would if it was just you know, like all one perspective. The older you get, the more people you see around you that you associate with, that like go to work and go home, go to work and go home. Like, right, they, it's that rat race. And they're like unhappy and they're like, and I'm unhappy sometimes too, but it's like, you know, it's like they wish, like people I talk to at work, they, they're envious that like, I have the thing that I'm a part of. Like, I feel really lucky. I've, I've played with tons of people in this town and before I moved here. And it's super awesome to play with these three people. It's, it's amazing. Uh, what I like most about the, my band members is that I can trust them as musicians and that they're all really unique and uh, inspiring individuals. It's been a lot of fun playing with these guys. It's different than any band I've ever been in. The dynamic is different. Um, but I love it, you know? Um, everybody brings something different. I feel like we all contribute a lot. I love them. Bunch of fucking assholes. But I love them. 